Well, today is the first Sunday where 16 and 17 year olds can work more hours. It's thanks to a new labor law that passed a week ago. CBS News Miami Steve Majuri talked to teens who can and will take advantage of this. I want to see four big rainbows and for Gisette Cuevas, teaching kids how to swim in Oak Aquatics isn't just a job. Same exact thing, okay? It's a way to make a difference. I think it's great teaching them lifelong skills. And since she loves the job, she may get to spend more time doing it. A new state law took effect on July 1st, allowing 16 and 17 year olds to work more than eight hours a day on holidays and Sundays. Hello, buddy. Let's get you ready. Gisette and her fellow swim teachers say they may take advantage of it since it's the summer. They gives us the opportunity to grow as employees, but also as people growing our skills teaching kids. There you go. All good? Her regional manager says this bill allows them to schedule more swimming lessons, which is a vital service in Florida since the Sunshine State often leads the country in child drownings per year. With this new law, we definitely want to make sure we utilize our um, team members and have more classes to have more safer swimmers coming into our pools. There's more flexibility in the summer, but during the school year, there's still a 30 hour a week cap for 16 and 17 year olds, unless their parents, guardians, or school superintendent waives it. This is one of two jobs for Gisette. She says during the school year, she may want to log more hours, since she says her senior year can rack up expenses. It's very expensive with all the field trips and the portraits and everything in general. We're told about 40% of Oak Aquatics instructors are teenagers. So this bill could help them schedule more classes on Sundays, which we're told are usually the busiest days of the week for them. In Southwest Miami-Dade, Steve Majiri, CBS News Miami.